Hello Stampers, it's Amy from Stampin' Magic, Independent Stampin' Up! Demonstrator. Today I thought I'd show you a way of decorating your monthly spread for the Love Today Planner. So today we're just going to be decorating the month spread of January. I do like to do my decorations like a few months in advance, um, just so I can just get planning straight away. Okay, today we're going to be using a few different Stampin' Up! products and a few other things from outside of Stampin' Up! But the main one we're going to be using is the Merry Cafe stamp set. It's got some really cute little stamps here that we can use to decorate. And this is a great one to have because you've got the small stamps for all occasions and all throughout the year. So we're going to be using this today. I've pre-cut some of the Year of Cheer specialty designer paper. I think this is really gorgeous. And I've basically cut it to fit the strips of what you'd use your wider washi for if you um, are familiar with planners and stickers sets and stuff you get wider washi to cover up these bits here so I've just cut some designer series paper and we're going to stick that down in the place of the washi I will be using some washi tape as well these are from paper chase and I believe these ones are from the works um, or tiger I can't quite remember what shop I got them from but you can pick up washi tape anywhere stamping up also does a really nice selection of washi tape I've just ordered some but I want to get ahead and do this video um, for you soon so I'm going to be using these ones um, these are the ones I've picked out like all the blues and kind of silvery grey colours to go with the snowflakes but I might not use them all so we'll just see how we go with that and I've also got some basic grey and soft sky ink which again will go over the whole theme of the snowflakes and winter. So today we're just going to be decorating it. Obviously um, I'm not going to know what I'm going to be doing in January as of yet. So I won't fill in any of that information. But there's lots of stamps out there and lots of stickers you can easily fill these in. And it's great to have this already decorated because I'll just pencil things in. And then when it comes to the start of January I'll sit down and do the whole whole month as a whole. To start with I've put in the the dates where they should be and I've used a silver gel pen for this. This is a new one I've got. This was from Paper Chase and it's really really nice. Normally with gel pens I find if you get the cheap ones they're kind of like scratchy looking. This is really nice. It's really smooth and as you can see it comes out really really nice in that. So I've just used that for them again to fit in with the winter theme so I'm going to go ahead and put some of the designer series paper strips down and the washi I'm going to fast forward this and then I'll come back when I'm ready to stamp Okay, so that's the main like bulk of the decoration done. Um, so I've just put some designer series paper here at the ends here and to cover this bit because that's not in use and that. You could also cut it so it covers this, but I'm going to do some snowflake things with this bit here. Um, this I didn't cut long enough, so I just had an extra one to cut there because I was running out of paper. Because I use this a lot, I love it. Okay, now we're going to get ready to do some stamping. So I've brought in a few snowflakes here. So I'm going to use the ones from the Merry Cafe stamp set, like I said. And I've also found this little tiny one in the Hang Your Stocking stamp set. Really cute stamp set. But any ones you've got any little snowflakes will be perfect for this. Um, I've pulled that one in so I want just a variation in size. So I'm going to do one page at a time. I've got basic grey ink. And the soft sky. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stamp in certain areas just to decorate it further and again I'll speed through this section. Okay. 
Okay, and that's our basic layout done. Um, of course, there's still more decoration to go as regards to what we're going to be doing on each day. Um, there's lots of stamps out where you can stamp in like agendas and if you're doing washing or if you've got meetings and there's stickers also. But it's just a basic layout to show how you can use um, designer series paper and stamps to just do a decoration on your monthly view. So if you like this video, please do give me a thumbs up and subscribe. The link to my blog and Facebook page are in the description bar below. And I hope you have a lovely day crafting. Goodbye.